Blackout 5, Bay Area County is facing power shutoffs as fire danger heats up this week. We've got your forecast and also the latest from PG&E. Plus, a follow-up on a story our consumer team has followed very closely. What is next for a developer accused of taking millions from customers without finishing the projects? People want to make uh, use Pamela Price as clickbait and put my name in a headline. She is defending her office. DA Pamela Price is speaking out about accusations of a massive backlog in cases and new criticism from a fellow DA. Her message to voters less than a month before they decide if she will keep her job. The News at 6 starts right now. Thanks for joining us. I'm Audrey Sistio. And I'm Jessica Aguirre. Tonight, another twist in the saga involving an ADU builder who went belly up, leaving dozens of Bay Area homeowners in a costly lurch. The company's chief just filed for bankruptcy protection. Yeah, consumer investigator Chris Kimura is following the money for us. Chris? Good evening. We are getting a rough outline of what was happening behind the scenes. Though customers still see millions of their money, and maybe even some of yours, missing. He bragged. I can tell you right now, a $100 million business. He boasted. We well, special day was part of the team's back to school in the Bay program meant to help kids in underserved communities. <laughs> well, tonight at 7, could this be a sign that Oakland is bouncing back? A number one ranking for Oakland's restaurant scene and a prominent lifestyle magazine. That story and more tonight in our 7 o'clock newscast. Up next on Nightly News, how canceling your subscriptions is getting much easier. Lester Holt joins us from New York right now.